Brooks was a courageous civil rights leader who planned her bold act to not give up her seat on a Montgomery, Alabama bus just because she was black. But she did it because somebody else had done it nine months earlier. And what was then considered a crime is still on that person's record. Claudette Colvin was the first black person to refuse to give up her seat on a Montgomery, Alabama bus. That was in March 1955, when she was 15 years old. Now, at 82, she's filed to have the criminal charges that have been on her record ever since removed. They shouldn't have been arrested because I wasn't breaking the law. Because she couldn't find work in Alabama after the incident, Colvin moved here to the Bronx, where she lived for more than six decades. And that was my best friend here. Why should they give her a hard time? You know, she's a, she's a lovely person, and I don't see why this happened when she was 15. She's 80-something years. Pilar Lata Villafane lived across a small hallway from Colvin for 21 years here in Parkchester in the Bronx until Colvin moved back to Alabama about a year ago. She called Villafane her best neighbor. Colvin signed that in the book written about her 12 years ago. She also said in the book that New York has given her so much for so many years. The Bronx remembers that Claudette Colvin is a New Yorker. Before she went back down south, the city renamed this block in her honor. Colvin found work for decades as a nurse's assistant at this Yorkville, Manhattan nursing home and became active in SEIU 1199, the union that represents health care workers. She said it all gave her strength to move forward. And now, newly returned to the South, she's strongly striking back. Yeah. It might not benefit you, but it'll benefit the next generation. And speaking of generations, the octogenarian had to go to juvenile court to file her request since it happened when she was in high school, her infraction. Both the mayor and the district attorney in Montgomery, Alabama, say it is highly likely that Claudette Colvin's record will be cleared. Finally.